Uh, hey guys, what's up? Anyway, this video is going to show you guys how to uh, install a custom APK plus its OBB files. Now this would work for any type of custom APK and OBB is done the same way for every single situation. But anyway, I'm going to be showing you on, uh, on I'm going to be showing you using my CSR2 uh, modded APK. So since I already, since I still have the old one here, I'm just going to uh, uninstall it. Alright, so let me uninstall this real quick. I'm using an emulator, but basically it's the same thing no matter what device you're using, whether it's a tablet, a phone, an emulator, etc. Alright, so it's all it's all it's all the same. So what you want to do is first download download the APK and download the uh, the uh, OBB files and extract those files somewhere. If you're using a computer, then extract it to a folder somewhere on your computer and then put it on the, and then uh, and, and then plug in your phone with uh, with the USB cable and transfer the files over. Um, if you're on your phone or your tablet device whatever just download the files unpack them and put them somewhere so like uh like i already have them technically on uh on the phone tablet thing whatever all right so uh, i just gotta go to the folder that that holds it so pull that out all right so um if i go into here here's my obb over here so this is my folder with the obb files all i, all I gotta do is i just gotta copy these i'm using a file manager um icon with the red folder so uh from there go to your uh Go to the roots of your uh, uh, directory, go to your SD card, then go to Android and go to OBB. Alright, and then paste this folder in. So I'm gonna hit that, let this finish. Alright, so once that's done, then go back to where you put the files at and uh, install the, the APK from there. I put mine's over here. Alright, because this is my work folder. So uh, yeah, and just install the game. All right, once that's done, APK is installed. Make sure you do the, if you do the OBB afterwards or before this, make sure you do that at some point. Don't do the OBB before uninstalling your old game because if you do that, you're gonna remove every single file, okay? Anyway, so just launch it. Just open, open it up. And it's, uh, it, uh, when you log into your Google thing, etc. you know, that sort of thing. All right, I cut out the loading section because I don't want this video being very long, but you can see that, hey, it does work. And uh, let me skip to being, to basically where, it, where I finished this, this race. All right, so I finished the race. Anyway, so let's go into, into buy cars and you'll be able to see that um, that the cars are super cheap. Uh, too bad I can't access these other, these other tiers from the get-go, but that'd be kind of cool if I could, but I can't. So anyways, you can see the cars are for super cheap for one dollar or uh, one gold. And since we only have gold at the beginning, that's all I can really use. But at least this way you get to save your gold if you start a new game. Okay. So I'm just going to get the Toyota 86. It's not a big deal. Alright. Hit OK. And as you can see, it only used up one gold coin. It wasn't anything big and it wasn't the full amount. So I still have 129 left from the starting amount. Alright, that's pretty much it. That's it. That's, uh, that's all that's required to install a custom APK and so on and so forth. All right. Now keep in mind, not all custom APKs that you download, like from other sources for other games, will allow you to use your uh, Google account without having some kind of special patching done to your phone and if your or, or or your device. And if it's not rooted, then you kind of can't do that special patching. So keep those things in mind. But otherwise, yeah, that's pretty much it. Alrighty, this is just my take on the whole uh, installing custom APK slash custom OBB files and so on. All right.